Hello, everyone. Welcome to Spelunking with Scoops. Uh, I feel like I should just end. This feature is nearing its its natural end. I'm joined by Max Temkin, uh, coach that I do really poorly in front of, and then apparently I have amazing runs immediately after. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, break break them down, build them back up. So yeah, yesterday uh, we did uh, just a practice run, and the practice run, you know, right now we've been working on getting to the city of gold, and we made it to the city of gold. Beat Olmec, got to Hell, got all the way to Yama. My first time in Hell, went through all of Hell's locations, uh, and then on the uh, ascent to Yama, was unfortunately hit by one of those little minions that dumps a bucket of lava. Now here's my question. If you get the amulet, does that protect you from that? I would think so. Because that's lava, right? I that's the whole point of the amulet, so. is you're protected from fire and lava damage. I'm going on the chat, and we'll see what the chat says. Okay. So I got killed by that. I had one health, I, I just skated through, and then I was slowly taking out the bats, I was luring them, bringing them down, hitting with the shotgun, moving my way up, and then just got anxious and got hit by what one of this? the lava. Why, why is there an ad on the stream? It, that, you hit play. It'll go away in a second. Oh, okay. Uh, um, people are saying yes. The pot hits you, though. Hmm. Interesting. There's a lot of no's and yes's. So when you get to Yama... Make a pole. Make a pole. Um, and then you have the little bats that dump the lava. If you have the amulet, are you protected from the lava? Yes. But what about getting hit by the pot? Because you, you can pick up the pot from it, so I assume it's also... If, if yeah, it has, it has physics and it can right. hit you. Yeah. If I know Spelunky, it can hurt you. Okay, yeah, okay, that's right. <laughs> Although the chat makes a good point, which is, who fucking cares? Don't get hit by the pot. Don't yeah, get hit by right. the lava. You're right, you're right, you're right. You shouldn't have to rely on the amulet. Right. Yeah. You, so, sh you shouldn't be at Yama and be like, oh, I could, uh, let's see, can I get hit? Which of these falling objects should, is, it, is it cool to get hit in the head with? Just, just don't get hit by anything. And by the way, what is this shit where you're done with Spawnky? Like, you're never done. No, in terms, I mean, of, like, doing, in terms of doing an extended, like, you can't play anymore. these daily features where they sometimes go two hours, like, they're, they're taking up too much of my day, work day. So oh, you're playing. important, uh, you got more important video games to stream than uh, Spawnky. Cool. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah like, well, uh, so... This may turn into like a roguelike feature, but I still want to do the dailies. It just may not be a thing I do during okay. the day. So it might be rotate to other games. Oh, that'd be cool. Like I feel like Yama is like, okay, that's the thing we show everyone up until. I'll still play it every night, but I might do the dailies on my own time. Uh, that'd be good. You could do like uh, you could do like the FTL hour. I could come in and get a little snooze in in the morning while you play. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Uh, so then after, uh, and so that was the daily. Uh, or no, that was the trial. And then on the daily, I was like, eh, you know, we'll see how far we get. And then I made it to four or five one, and then died uh, immediately. Uh, I got the amulet, and then just yeah, hell's not very fun. Hell's not very fun. So that's you're now we're on equal standing in terms of because uh, you've never beat. Yama. I have been to Yama several times. I have never beaten Yama and won the game. Last weekend, Greg Woolen and I played a co-op, and we said, you know what? I'm done with this shit. I'm gonna kill Yama. I'm gonna beat the game. And we had a first run, and we died in, like, the jungle. It was shitty. And then we, we stealed our resolve. I was very hungover. I think I took a nap, and then I was feeling better after my nap. And then we did our run, and we got to hell. And we killed Yama, working as a team. And then we got cocky, and we're like, you know what? Let's go get those rubies. Let's really get a good score on this run. So Greg has a jetpack, and I have the cape. So Jeg Greg jetpacks up into the area with the rubies under Yama, oh, and he lays down a bunch of bombs and he immediately gets hit by a tiki and dies. And I don't see that, because I'm on my Vita and you have different screens. So I am, as Greg dies, I am floating in with the cape, and I land right as the bombs explode and they kill oh. me. So we actually killed Yama and did not beat the game. That's really great. Yeah, and I've still never killed Yama and beaten the game. I'm, I learned not to play with Greg. That's a good lesson. Should we introduce all the people in the room? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. We should do that. So we have uh, my friend Tommy. He's a writer in Chicago, and he uh, shares the, the Cards Against Humanity uh, co-working office. Uh, so I introduced Tommy to Splunky, and then under my uh, tutelage, he became uh, a, a Splunky expert, and now he regularly can beat the game and crush me in the dailies, and he's way better than me. And uh, my friend Jana, who's an illustrator, and we've done a bunch of projects uh, and worked together. She's done a bunch of work for Cards Against Humanity, and she's also a beekeeper in Chicago. Just a giant Spelunky fan. Jana's a, a professional Spelunky watcher. <laughs> yeah, that's accurate. 
All right, so right now I'm just, I'm not going on a serious run. I'm just getting my, my feel for the physics before I do uh, the daily, just as a warm up. Um, and then we'll just jump, we'll just jump straight to the daily. Because yesterday, I, <laughs> these features are supposed to go like 40 minutes, and then yesterday was like two Ooh. hours. Oh, I'm not playing seriously. Um, who, <laughs> the Greg. Wow, the, wow, look at that, look at that. The Greg that we're uh, talking about is Greg Woolen. Uh, he's the game designer who made uh, Hundreds, and he uh, did all the art for Ridiculous Fishing, and uh, he did uh, Basketball and Saw Obscure. And, um, and, and has a new game stuff. coming out, yeah, Threes. Uh, yeah, which next, dropping, which dropping next play. Thursday. Are we yeah. allowed to say that? Yeah, we are. Oh, okay. You yeah. Yeah. Oh. And, yeah, my wife uh, is very upset that I redeemed uh, the code he sent me on on my phone. Mm. Uh, and then at your party, like in, in between moments when she wasn't talking to someone, she's like, give me your phone. Just give me your damn phone. Yeah. Threes is, threes is I'm, I'm not much of a puzzle game guy, but Threes is really good. I, I, I think it's going to become like one of those like standard, like, uh, Spell Tower. Type no, games now we're ready for the deal. There's, uh, there's a key. There's a chest. There were phone. 48 bombs. In there. It's all about the daily. It's all about the daily. Uh, people are asking about beekeeping, Jana. You beekeep in Chicago. It is not indoors. That would be stupid. It is, it is outdoors in the summer, and it's urban beekeepers. Beekeeping. Yeah, it's all over the city in. Uh, you gotta talk in this microphone. Sorry, it's all over the city in urban gardens and uh, community gardens and farms, and I visit them all by bicycle. And right now the bees are just huddled up in their hives, trying to stay warm, eating honey, and then come springtime, we'll start beekeeping again. You know we're a lot do? of people uh, on the um, Splunky stream uh, go to uh, farmers markets and buy artisanal honey, so Good. I think that's a big crossover support, demographic. Support, yeah. <laughs> support your local beekeeper. I've got to make a change quick. Oh shit! <clears throat> I forgot my sprite. Oh, oh shit! Yeah, that's the most important thing. That's really cool. Yeah. I've gotten stung maybe about eight times a year, and considering I'm around hundreds of thousands of bees, it's okay. Jana, will you be able to advise Patrick if he comes to a bee's nest in the jungle? Will you be able to give him good advice? Yeah, I'll just take the mic from you and start telling him what to do. Okay. Yeah, well, yeah that's a problem. That's been a, historically, that's been a problem. Patrick, are we still on? The audio's still on, right? No, people can hear us talk. Okay, so I got to narrate what's happening right now. So that Patrick has uh, blacked out the screen on the stream here, but he is on uh, FileDropper.com trying to find which button here is actually the download button <laughs> so he can download the special sprite of his Spelunky character. That's what, it's got to be like the shittiest thing on the internet. Character? Yeah. So, so oh my god, lucky right. you! It's gonna be the shittiest thing on the internet where it's like they have the fake download button. Like, yeah, it'll trick them into clicking on some ads. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, if bees go extinct, we are screwed. That is true. That's a good observation. Yes. Don't do it. No, it's not the big one that says download. That uh, took us to a, a naked lady. That's the wrong button. That's why we have the screen blacked off. All right, it's downloaded. Was that the wrong button, Max? It's the one that took us to a naked lady. Call, call, they want us to call Vinny and ask him which download button to press. Vinny went on this famous quest to find a patch once that like took him through just like a million download sites and they just streamed the whole thing. It's oh, like really? Show the nightmare. Oh, I gotta find that. That's really funny. Someone find the link to the thing with Vinny. Slowly down. Is it worth it for me to bring my computer in? Sure. The chat's fun. Jana, here's the gift. So this is the, the guy, Fab Wash, who does the, the gifts of Patrick. So here's Patrick, and he's, here's the bees coming. So he's on top of the tree, and he bombs the tree. This is the good part. <laughs> <laughs> and he flies all the way over there. Yeah. That was really good. This is good radio. Yeah, yeah. Okay, there we go. That one looks better okay. than the bat tech one had me on. It was the, the Euro Truck Simulator Quick Look. Oh, okay. Okay. I'll, I will uh, I'll watch that. Chat is like my version of the Star Trek computer. Yeah. Someone get me a coffee. Does that work? All right. I have a lot of links to the Euro Truck Simulator. Uh, people, for people who are just, yeah, it's Plunkin' with Scoops, for people just joining in, 
uh, Patrick is right now downloading a, a special, uh, uh, what is it, a special build of the game? Or just inserting... No, it's just a, it's a texture swap. Okay, he's doing a, a, or like a sprite a texture, swap. A sprite swap in the game so we can play with the, the Patrick character. We should be good to go now, theoretically. And we're back. Uh, no, cap the cool captains, Captain Janeway and Captain Cisco. They drink coffee, so there I am. Cisco drinks clean coffee. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so. All right, we'll back out and go to the daily. It's your cute little nose. I know it's really good. Yeah, this guy Fobwashed on our, our forums does just really phenomenal work, and this is above and beyond even what he normally does. I forget. I don't know which one it replaces, though. But there I am. Let's go do this, buddy. If we're gonna, if we're gonna beat Yama, you and I, we're gonna do it together. I sometimes I see Colin Northway at like events and stuff. Oh, look at the little bomb too. Oh yeah, he replaced it to the giant bomb God, spray. That's so oh my stupid. God, look at that. Yeah. Yeah, it's uh, it's really. I didn't even I didn't even know he did that until I played it and then. Uh, Is it like a cookie basket or something? Yeah. Yeah, Fabwash is the best. Yeah, send him a package of uh, 500 live bees. I That'll know. be a funny gif. Sure of him opening it. <laughs> Are people seriously saying that Cisco is not a cool captain on Star Trek? What's wrong with you people? I don't have any comment. I've seen no Star Trek. I keep waiting for Max's mythical blog post he keeps telling me. Yeah, about. well, you can't even start on Deep Space Nine, though. You really should start watching no, like, Next Gen. We've had this conversation. Yeah. yeah. No, he, he couldn't hit me when I came up. Um, so, okay, so Pat, this is just an, another start. No, it's a daily challenge. Oh, this is the daily. This oh, is the okay, daily. Cool. We're just wow. going for it. I guess you pay attention here. So, Patrick, what's the, what's the goal for the daily? Are you trying to get to City of Gold? Yeah. Okay. Hey, now that we've been to, to Hell and Yama, like, that is. That is goal number one uh, going forward. Like, if we've done it, that is now achievable. Uh, that is something we can do. Um, hey, there you go. That's nice. nice. You guys are getting some hot tips for this daily, too. That's okay. Don't worry. Uh, when I when I play these on this, when I play these on, I, it's really weird that I do much better when I'm by myself with a stream of thousands of people watching than it is with like two people in a room and suddenly that's when I mess it up. That's just the way it goes. Patrick, people uh, are in the chat are saying it didn't look like you selected the daily challenge. Are you sure not? you're doing the daily? Mm, is there a way? Oh, end adventure. Cool. I guess I didn't. Would okay. it still say that? Yeah, yeah, I gonna, don't know. No. Yeah, don't, no, yeah. don't end the yeah. You can end the daily. Do not end the adventure. The adventure must continue. <laughs> we Would must, it say end we daily? We must continue adventure. No. I don't think so. I don't know. I think it would be given on menu. I don't think the menu would tell you. No, they're right. This is the daily. The chat is trying, the chat is trying to get me to quit the daily. That's not nice. Yeah, I, can you believe it that the giant wow. bomb? That the giant wow, bomb look at them! Base? Look what them just tried to do! They tried to get me to quit the daily! You were, hover, you were hovering over the quit button, too. You're like, yeah, I, I could probably press that. <laughs> yeah. Okay, this is the daily. Everyone's saying it's the daily. Tana, can you believe that users on Giant Bomb would tell someone to do something that wasn't helpful or accurate to them? I for, one, I, for one, can't believe, <laughs> I can't believe it. I've never, uh, never heard of anything like that. Monsters. I like to have faith in people, I guess. There. Yeah, it's a lot of pro Remo thugs in the chat today. I think. Yeah, I, th I think. I, I think after. So apparently, uh, when we had uh, where we beat Remo uh, earlier this week, um, when I beat Olmec, uh, so Remo would have beaten me, but he died during Olmec. Like he, oh, he screwed wow. up, so he would have gotten uh, the extra hundred thousand that you get from uh, defeating Olmec. Uh, and beaten me, but he he screwed up, which is why that's why he was so upset about it because he had it in his grasp and then completely screwed it up. I think it's only fifty thousand. Is it fifty thousand? Yeah. Either way, I beat him by twenty, okay. so it would have it would have been well, over. Then fuck that guy. Exactly. Yeah. See, see, see. Patrick, just want to say nice nice job with that room on the right there. Very Thank cautious. You. Thank you. Very thoughtful. Oh, I actually oh, and yesterday I did ghost mining for the first time during 
the daily. And really? people were people were very upset that I was doing it. Uh, but it's it was incredibly boring. It was in the caves. Uh, I had a jetpack. Like it was about as safe as you're gonna get uh, with ghost mining. And at some point, I need to, I need to rip the bandaid off. People are asking, is there is it common is it common for the, there to be uh, this much gold in one one? So first of all, we're not in one one. I think this is one two. Yeah. Um, but. It is not common. One one is usually a more empty level. There's a lot of treasure going on. Though. Yeah, this is a treasure rich seed so far. So, but that just means everyone else has got it too. So it doesn't really mean a whole lot. Not seen. Hey, buddy. Ooh. Not seen the chest yet. You'll wanna there we go. You want to go back and get the bomb from the shop too. Yeah, that's a good call. Ooh. Good call, Coach Tommy. Coach T. <laughs> Guys, if Patrick was a high school football player, what do you think his nickname would be on the team? Now, Scoops isn't a cool. That's, yeah, football that's not a cool name. football name. Yeah. Well, um, it, just to be clear. Like, if your I name started with a T, you would definitely yeah, be that's T. That, yeah, that's a, that's maybe the, like the, the, maybe let's question the premise. Right. That's not a cool high school football name. Well. What do you expect from me? Um, people are asking what's up with the skin. This is uh, a, a Patrick, a sprite that uh, Fob Wash in the chat made. Um, so Patrick is doing the daily with uh, the special texture pack uh, that puts him in the game. It's truly me winning this. If I do Oof, it with me. Tricky, just P, that's a good one. Yeah, Tricky was my original. <laughs> this is Jebediah. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. P bomb, I like that. P bomb's pretty good. P bomb, That's, that does seem right. like a football name. Yeah. He's really badass, so mysterious. Oh, and I, I also actually. Uh, I'm going with P bomb. Yesterday I did the your uh, trick that you tried to teach me before you almost sent me to my doom with uh, grabbing a crate and uh -huh. then opening it. So I actually managed to do that. It does work. It if does. You, work. If you're holding the crate. Yes. Okay. Hold it and then hit up and yes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Patrick's holding the shotgun, and I tried to tell him that trick, and the, the I, I had a, not only a shotgun, but was in the caves and was like right next to a little section. And had I not just tapped A, I, right. it, the whole thing would have been that would have been, been all yeah. over. Yeti spike pit. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So far, so good. Oh, uh, shouldn't have yep. said anything. Yep. Wow. Never evaluate so the game in the game. P bomb, really disappointed in you. Re very reckless uh, pot opening. That's all right. I got my I got my dog. Club, club hacker. Got my dogs. Green Bay club hacker. Hey, come on. No, none of that Green Bay nonsense. <laughs> Pudding clubbing. <laughs> skinny P. Ooh, Skinny P is a good one, guys. Klepto. <laughs> sure. Oh, Just video game scoops. <laughs> <laughs> Video game scoop. It's terrible. <laughs> but pretty good. Pretty good. Oh, it's weird me out to have the uh, the climbing gloves this week. Ooh. <laughs> that was a lot of nonsense. That's like where you have an instance where like an arrow somehow ricochets and just takes you out in the worst way possible. There's a classic Bombs going on in this uh, in this daily. Look at you not going after that spider. I know. You know. You learn. You learn. Did it already go? No. Oh. Hmm. Yeah, so bad dudes. Bad shit going down in this. Hey, Patrick. Just. You know that walking under those big spiders triggers them, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Because you do that all the time. I know. I forget that it triggers them when you are not on their level. Oh, Say right. That. When you're like, yeah. Like if I was under here, uh, yeah. sometimes I will forget that. But sometimes I find I just screw up taking them out that I will just trigger them and just take my luck uh, moving on, which I would say works about 50 Yeah, there is just a ton of stuff going on here. 
I've, I've, I've never seen anything, anything like this. You guys, I read the craziest thing the other day that I, I have to do. I have to go read some more about it because it seems implausible. But I was reading that they were doing um, like uh, uh, st studying like mummies, like dissecting mummies, and they found trace amounts of tobacco and cocaine in the mummies' uh, like digestive system, which means that they think that means maybe the, the ancient Egy Egyptians had some sort of trade or contact with America, with the New World. Yeah, you're right. Is that the craziest thing? You've ever oh, heard? you monsters! Patrick, <laughs> stop listening to my fascinating stories and focus on your game. No, the arrow hit me. Oh, Sometimes that happens. You predicted it. Sometimes that happens. Those arrows are monsters. But then someone else pointed out that they've, like, all those old mummies, they've moved them, like, 20 times, so it's possible that, like, the moving guy just spilled some coke on them. Yeah, that sounds more likely. Oh, it was coca? Coca? Like, chocolate? Chocolate. Coca is from like a specific plant, and then cocaine made of that. Oh, okay. So it was co coca. Yeah. Right. Excuse, so excuse me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Max. Yeah, it's, uh, These people are gonna distract me with stories. Could they be accurate? Can we learn real things, Max? Like new spelunky tips. There are just crates everywhere in this one. <laughs> yeah, I know. At some at some point, this is gonna turn, right? right. Do a sacrifice? No. Okay. <laughs> I've never seen that. Yeah, that's that's a hot spelunky tip right Dad, there. Dad, what a treat. No, do the other side. You think that? Mmm. Oh, oh, we're in the shop. We're okay. It's only two squares. Oh, the glasses. You're in it. Yeah, now. you know now now I'm. Yeah. In, in one of my runs yesterday, they took me to hell. Uh, three different jetpacks. Two in the black market, one that came in a box. It was ridiculous. They really wanted you to use the jetpack. Uh, tick, tick, tick. Mm. I don't trust myself. I would say it's pretty uncommon that the that the black market is in 2 1 it's, it's yeah way, I, it's not, it's way I've, more I've, common that it's in 2 2 or 2 3 where it's up there it is oh great <laughs> it's not that now i'm killing it cuz when you, you get two go, two wait wait stop you want to go over the top of those spikes through that path. Right, you'll cover more ground with the... Look at that, tips. With the eye, and you'll avoid a shit of those spikes. Hot tips, hot For tips. The of, like, For the low, low cost of two bucks. Uh-oh. That time, don't let Max stress you out. Max always stresses out. I'm barely even paying attention. <laughs> <laughs> Just in life. It's just like it was... I'm barely paying attention to Max Do you know how many shits I give right now? <laughs> so few. Remarkably few. Oh no! Please! I'm, I'm, I'm bored of Splunky and I'm really into mummies now. <laughs> so, if you do a new stream about mummies. <laughs> Alright, Jana, we need you. This is your time. Do I this really want it. more bombs? Yes. Kill the queen. 42 bombs. Anymore, so is that how you, when bombs? you're beekeeping, how many bombs do you usually use? Uh, you know, between 10 and 20. Uh, uh, what do I, I want to do here? Queen, like, okay. like bomb them here? Yeah. And that way, the little guys can come through, but the big okay. members are too you're gonna, big. you're gonna set that shopkeeper off if the bees get through to him. So just make sure. Yep. Okay. 
Sticky, sticky, sticky the queen. Yeah. Yep. Nice. Yeah. Nicely done. Yeah. Boom. Oh, your first queen that I see. At least on, on this one. So where, is, where is where the sap? It, it, it just went down to. Oh, it goes left. with her. No, it, no, it went down to the left. It just gets to the left. Get the, uh -oh. the dog. The dog. I guess you don't really need it. But now I hope I didn't skip the black market. Do you know you can sort of skim over those pools? If you jump right when you hit it, you, you don't actually go in the water. Oh, That's really? That's a hot tip. Yeah. I didn't know that tip. Yeah. Watch out for your old friend, the fish skeleton. Okay. I think we're good. I think so. Also, watch out for that guy with the fish. Once you grab that boomerang. Oh. Nah, don't, don't bother with that boomerang. It's not that great. Yeah. <laughs> I've heard that taking uh, items in between levels is overrated. Yeah, why even use items? I, I feel like that's cheating. See, he's getting cocky. You got to Yama, and now you're like, ah, I won't, I won't take the... Go ahead, sure, go ahead, touch the corn baller. Don't bring the boomerang. <laughs> you know what? I don't need this jetpack. Who needs, the, who needs these shotguns? and boomeranging except... There we go. <laughs> Why are is he? Why were you skipping the bombs in the last shop? Because you want to beat Remo, and the money is important. Yeah, and I'm already. Like, I'm at forty. You have forty bombs. Like, that's pretty much a good number to beat the game. Where is that? It's gonna be down. Yeah. There you go. There it is. Right behind the guy. Oh yeah. Right behind the guy. The loot. Oh, shit. Oh, get we're okay. We're okay. We're okay. We're okay. <laughs> I, as Greg as Greg says, in total control. I'm in complete in control complete at all times. In complete control yeah. at all times. Just looking around. See if there's an easy dog. Looking for some tails. Looking for some easy Look dog. Looking for a damsel. He's DDR. Down to damsel. Yeah, I love that honey. The honey sound effect is so satisfying. I will kill the queen just to get the sound effect. Yeah. Okay, I got enough bombs. I got ropes. I don't think. And this is look, home. And, look at all these bombs. Yeah, you're gonna rob this black market. Oh, I always rob the black market. Always rob the. Did you check out the third level too? Did you see what's down there? There's, just, there's, there's, one, there's one more. Yeah. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Stick to my tried and true cocky. No, it's just I've been fine. P bombs getting cocky over here. Tricky P bombs. Where are you, buddy? Come on. Where's my second friend? Big plays. We're seeing, seeing a lot of big plays today, I feel like. Yeah, because sometimes he comes out right away, right. and then sometimes he doesn't, and then you get a little so, you get a little cocky and just decide to go for it and yeah. it goes really. So cool. there's a way to make sure that they come out if you're down on their level, you just have to leave like, enough to like block them actually. Hey Patrick, I don't wanna see you jump down into the chamber with the Ankh until you've cleared out that second level. I die like that often. I feel like you're getting lucky on these black markets. So I was getting lucky when I played Dark Souls. I get lucky when I play Spelunky. Can never be that Patrick's just doing okay, huh? No. You got lucky. Someone you got a good seed. No skill. Yeah. Just so grab that shotgun. Fire the shotgun down, down there. Yeah, that's what I was going to yeah, do. Okay. Yeah, grab yeah, that just, and then just fire it. Just clear it out. Okay, you're, you're safe. Now you go grab me on. But I, you often jump down there without checking that level, and it, it scares me. Is there anything else? Just go, yeah. Nope. Hired hand. Let's get out of here. 60 bombs, man. That went relatively well. That was pretty easy. This little, yeah, like ever since Max explained that technique for me, I use it every single time, and, uh, you know, other than just like, you know, Spelunky being Spelunky, um, I usually have pretty good success with it. Did Greg teach you that one? That's a Doug Wilson method. Oh. Yeah. 
It just compartmentalizes everyone into really good <clears throat> spots. <laughs> Hubris scoops. <laughs> yeah, sure. Uh, I don't have a jetpack, which is uh, usually what I've had when I've made it this far. So, but at least uh, I have you, the climbing you, gloves. You need some flying. I don't have any. I don't have a cape. Yeah. So what are we looking at here? Is this a Yeti level? Yep. So you'll. Oh my Get God. Come on, buddy. Yep. There's gonna be a good amount of crates if this is a Yeti level. Is that indicative of a, a Yeti level? Could be a cave. Yes. You're gonna you're probably also gonna get spicy though. No, I don't. Show that guy who's boss. Damn yeah, right. What's up, Mr. Yeti? Yeah, so you just start shooting across. No, I'd yeah, huck some bombs. Why don't you huck some bombs over there? You, you have them. Oh, God! <laughs> oh, <laughs> that didn't work. Oh, how did that happen? He's oh. Up. Oh. 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 oh! I forgot about the icicles. Hubris scoops. We got forgot some real about the icicles. We got some real hubris scoops on this uh, on the stream today. That sucks. Oh man. Um, okay, so get the bomb. So get the gun. Start chucking bombs. Just chuck a shitload of bombs. Right so there. maybe he'll fall. No, just across. Oh well, how about <laughs> what there? What, what about doing? up there? No. What are you doing? Literally <laughs> throw. Just hit. Me. There you go. Wow. Now, the now my coaches are getting angry. <laughs> They're yelling at me. We're not giving constructive. We're telling them what buttons. Just to hit. hit the B button. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even know what it does. Just hit it. Uh, Baby steps. Well, that's unfortunate. We'll kill him because he's got good loot when he dies. Gotta be Vimo. Yeah. Oh my. I'm, pr I'm protected. He's, there's the things above me. He's just gonna keep doing that. <laughs> but he's gonna run out of stuff. <laughs> hey, buddy. Oh, oh great, no. great. Anger Kali. You yeah. used 10 bombs to get the compass and the boots. Congratulations. <laughs> and you pissed off Kali. You yeah. know what? Sometimes, you just, sometimes shit goes down in Spelunky, you know? <laughs> just hit me. <laughs> so this, is, this is why I stay home. This is why I stay home. <laughs> You didn't even get the crate under the thing? Nah, the, the ghost was coming. Oh, okay. Well, he's got the bombs because he holds it. Do you just, do you get the, do you get it by just hitting B? Is that how I get the, is that how I get the crate? No, you actually got to apply yourself and you got to wow. go down there and get it. Wow, wow. Critical thinking. Yeah. Man. Don't pay for these coaches, guys. I, I'm going to let you know. Not, don't get your money's worth. Yeah, that's definitely yeah. Oh, look at that. It's right there. It's right there. You do the worm? Uh, oh, well, no, I, I lost it. Look at that. Watch this. Whoa. <laughs> Crate tech. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, I didn't see the damsel. We could do the, we could do the worm. This seems like a good way to kill myself. There's no money in the worm. Well, well. But there is this. Strife but there is the Christ. Oh, or you could try the mothership. You can do. Uh, you could try the mothership and try and get the alien you, cannon. You, that's pretty you, cool. So the Christ knight and the alien go to What? Yeah, but it's not the Christ. Knight. What's mm. your plan here? Why are you doing this? Uh, it's, uh, no, I'm not sure if I'd call it a plan. Okay. No. I think it'd be called <laughs> dying. I was watching that and I was like, I didn't think, I was I like, didn't think about it. Should I should, if I just did B, then it might have all, might have all yeah. gotten solved. Let's that see what didn't happened. seem like the best. Oh, but we still beat Maybe Chris Remo. Remo. Uh, we still beat Jeff Gersman. Who's so on? Who's so on? Uh, might just be a random giant bomb user. Oh, okay. I think. But look at Full Wash. Look yeah. at him. He earned it. Yeah, he damn. earned it. He made it all the way to hell. That's a tough seed um, too. No, it's not. Wow. <laughs> wow. Uh, so I beat I beat Chris Remo. So you know that's you beat, you beat Jeff, and I beat Jeff. I don't know where uh, where's today. Oh yeah, today. Jeff died in one one. Uh, that's all it is. Brad didn't play today. Be Sean McGinnis. All right, hey, you know you take what you can get. Okay, all right, shit talkers. Who wants to play now? Okay, all right. See Tommy do. I'll see Tommy do a run. Tommy's a very technical Splunky player. That's how I would describe him. 
it's Spelunky is like a puzzler for me. Like I, it's just several puzzles in a row. Oh, so it looks like it replaced the default guy. Congratulations, Pat. You're the new default. Damn right. Default is me. We haven't been to the worms, so there's no. Uh, you don't have your your meat boy. Yeah, and you don't have the Mexican either. I didn't say that. I'm Cuban. Yeah, so uh, I definitely feel like we're nearing the natural end of this stream, and I think you've really mastered the game. <laughs> you've, you've learned everything from the I mean, what do, you, what do you guys say? One or two more days? What do you think? I think yeah, it's... Yeah. Just like one more run. Yeah. Oh, boy. <sighs> Everyone moves so much faster than me. So well, we've played. A, I played a lot. Played a lot. Like you just, I, I you just get two and a half weeks in. Yeah. Oh, I've been playing for like a year. So, and you're roughly as good as me. So. Yeah. You should be proud of that. You don't have yeah. to be fast. <laughs> yeah. Uh, let's see you do a solo eggplant run, and then we'll. Uh, yeah. I don't. I would be if you could just whip kill Yama. I would say that would be enough for me. How many bounces does Yama take? Do people do that, Tommy? It's been done four. I want to say like one for each hand. Minimum one four, one for each hand, and then two for the I head. I think it takes more like six on his head. Oh, six on. But you get twenty-four good. bombs for walking in the door. Right. Right. When you kill horse head and the other one. I have a tough time with Yama too because uh, if you don't have the the pitcher's mitt, it's very hard to hit Yama with the bombs what from the, safety. What does the pitcher's mitt do? The pitcher's mitt makes you throw everything like a rock. So you know how when you throw a rock? No. Well, it, the it, it, it's mitt even makes more everything exaggerated. you throw in, go in a straight line. Yeah, it goes. You know when you throw the rock, it just has like a way more like velocity. Yeah. The pitcher's mitt exaggerates that even more. So it just throws it to the whatever wall, a straight in a straight line straight at a high line. velocity as far as it goes until it hits a wall. So it, it becomes much harder for me to like, I, I just like the arc of the bomb, like the physics of that a lot more for like actually like maneuvering the bombs where I need them to go. Like it's very hard for me to do the black market if I have the, the catcher's mitt. So like theoretically, ideally you would want the, the, the catcher's mitt after the black market. Yeah, you'd want it in like the ice caves or something. You, Tommy, you don't think so? I, I, I think that if you're relying on the, the pitcher's mitt to do the black market, or to not, if you're relying on not having that, um, you're doing it wrong. Well, I just have, I, I waste a lot more bombs. Like, I, I can predict, I'm not as good at predicting where they'll go. And there's the key. Uh, some folks were asking what an eggplant run is. So, if you sacrifice a present on an altar, you get an eggplant. And, like, like for an a while, literal eggplant. not like in the real world, Jenna. Like in the game, it's an easy mistake to make. Uh, <laughs> that was immediately no, condescending. I know that, Tommy. <laughs> Jesus. I know how physics works. Um, so you get an eggplant, and it changes the music all weird and eight bitty, but it's not in any of the documentation. For a while, the create Derek and Andy, the creators of the game, like denied that it existed. It was just this mysterious thing. And then someone discovered that if you take the eggplant all the way to Yama, um, you can turn Yama into a giant eggplant monster. And he looks, so I, if I take this present actually up to the altar of Kali and sacrifice the present, I would get an eggplant. Hmm. The thing is, it's, it shouldn't be possible to do it on your own. It, you should only be able to get the eggplant to Yama in a co-op mode, but there's a particular bug that lets you get it through the Mayawi head. And the eggplant is also incredibly fragile. Um, like pretty much any part of it. Like will, will, anything will that hits it. it will destroy it. <laughs> Everyone's just, the chat just wants to see an eggplant right now. <laughs> yeah, it's it's not, it shouldn't I, even yeah. be, honestly, it shouldn't even be possible for one player to do it. It's more of like a co-op thing. And you're, uh, you're, you're exploiting a glitch. Yeah. Right. 
Um, I'm not good enough to do an eggplant run. I'm no Patrick Klepek in two days. <laughs> I definitely, uh, I definitely recommend uh, this article. I'm gonna link it in the chat. It's this, um, this article from Doug Wilson uh, about the solo eggplant run. He sort of breaks down a play-by-play of how it went, and there's a really good video. Uh, it's a really nice piece. I think that's actually yeah. the article Patrick said got you into mm-hmm. Splunky, actually. So. It's the most comprehensive eggplant literature out there. Yeah. <laughs> Really I was going to say, yeah, you, you, hit, you hit that spider mid-stride. Yeah, it was like above you and your whip. Dude, Mike Boxlider, he will whip the arrows out of mid-air. That's amazing to me. I don't know. I don't know how anyone does that. But oh, a bat. Oh, bat tech. Oh, real close. Seeing, right there. Seeing, some, seeing some classic bat tech on this one. Puppy. 30 bombs, damn. Yeah, Spider was like, hey, you know what? Go fuck yourself. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I got this friend here. Why did you cover that spike up there? I didn't notice that. Look That's at smart. you. Hot tips. Inventing future errors. Oh, he's got the cup. Oh. This is this is all it's escalated quickly. Going it's getting good. Going well. Yeah. Good for him. Nerdle? <laughs> <laughs> Even if I had the money, What's I would. Tommy, buy walk, walk me through your reasoning. Why didn't you grab that skull? Are you are you a carry thing through other levels sort of guy or? ABC, not really? always be carrying. Tommy's just ascended to a level in this game where he doesn't even need items. He's just like, ah, He just walks it. in and all the traps go off. <laughs> <laughs> like, he, he's like Neo from the Matrix. The arrow's <laughs> flying at him and he just like puts up his hands. It falls down out of midair. Is this the daily? This is not the daily. This nope. is our friend Tommy is just uh, doing a, a run on the stream. Yeah, Patrick, Patrick already did the daily. What are you gonna do if you? What do you get if you sacrifice the dog? So yeah. for two more, for the price of two more damsels, uh, Kali would give me a shitload of health, like, like seven health or something like that. But there's you no, if you're gonna kill yourself with, the yeah, bombs are damsels one arm. You just tuck her under the armpit and go. So that's already gone off. Oh, that's some bad tech. I'm gonna run that bat around. You're not gonna attack by the dog again? Nope. Because even if I get the health. You have the Kapala. I'm, I'm right. Yeah, when right. I have the Kapala, two, I'm gonna sacrifice myself in the ice caves anyways, so it's too early for all that health. Like it would go to waste. Such a wise man. So a lot of people a lot of people what they'll do is they'll try and sacrifice one damsel or get like right up close to getting the the health bonus from Kali and then they wait until after the Ankh and then they just have to do like it's real easy. You sacrifice anything and you get a bunch of health. So you sort of set yourself up in the early game. Because you get a lot more opportunities for the sacrifices in the early game than the late game. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. I don't, does, they, does the shrine even appear in this temple? Yes. I gotta see if that happens. There's a special seed of the temple where it's like the Kali pit. You'll oh, see. Oh, I've never gotten that. I've oh, is that where you that. see like, oh, people are praying to mm-hmm. the Kali yeah, yeah, yeah. at the beginning of the... Okay. Fuck. That's real weird, Tommy. Why don't you just bomb the tree? And you might be thinking, did I just whip his boomerang right the fuck out of the air? And the answer is yes. Yeah! Cool. Just wanted to kill that guy just to show him what's what? Well, also for the blood. Oh, right. Always for the blood. A B A B B. Always be bleeding. <laughs> I like that the, <laughs> I like that the chat calls that juicing the dog. <laughs> Get that dog. Really dude. close to you know, yeah. Hey, uh, Patrick, do you, uh, juice, do you remember to juice the dog today? I juiced my dog before. Oh, he's going to juice here. all over the rug. <laughs> listen, listen. God. I know you're nervous. It's a blind date. Make sure you juice the dog. Ew. Sorry. Oh, no? Oh, all right. Tommy. Really? That yeah. was the thing? You got to sacrifice the collie by juicing the dog. Up until now, we were talking about dog blood. And then you went there.
tricky. Wait, you're really taking out those critters for the blood. Sorry, I'm like 10 minutes behind. I'm watching on the stream for some reason. Um, I do that sometimes when Patrick's playing and I yell advice at him that's 10 minutes old. Oh, oh that's ah, really wow, bad. You're going to wow. fuck him up so bad. Not on purpose. No, I got, the, I got this series of text messages because my phone was upstairs when I was playing. Either earlier this week or last week. <laughs> it was just, his message was like, Grab the blood, you fool! You're not even trying! <laughs> watching this stream at home. <laughs> You're not even trying. Do you, think, do you really think he's checking his phone while he's playing? Yeah. Sometimes, because he's called me before. I, and I've taken his call on the stream. I care. <laughs> I care. I heard ABC that. always be caring. You can also tell me. If you go to the worm, I, here's Tommy. You probably know this. I'm, I'm not clear on this. If you go to the worm, does it can it obscure the black market from you? So it you... absolutely can okay. because the worm skips two. So, oh. What are you? Thinking? What are you doing right now? I'm getting out. Okay. I was gonna go grab that dog. Oh. Okay. I saw a terrible chill. You don't okay. need the dog. You just milked it for all of its. <laughs> you juiced it. Juice. Yeah, you juiced it. Good. Right, and the boomerang's more important because critters. Yeah. See that critter? That critter's fucked. Black market. So what is the point of the worm then, do you guys think? Is it just a different way to play the game? Like You get the Christ knife, which which like one hits just about anything. It just explodes it into a a, a glorious blood splatter. But like, is that gonna be useful if you're trying to do other things like get the hell? What the Oh, uh, the, the frog? Oh my god, the I orange can't- orange frog opened the black market for you. That's the luckiest thing in the world, because normally would have taken out the altar, and then Kali would have been just furious. She really likes you, right? Yeah, Kali and I are bros. You got the spike shoes? Oh, yeah. Oh. Could have gotten, gotten that honey. Get that honey. Well, hi, Greg. Hey. Oh, we got a full house today. Developer of three coming out. <laughs> Next Thursday on iOS. Hey, hey did everyone in the <laughs> did everyone in the chat get Octodad? Has everyone played Octodad? You, you have to leave now. Yeah, I honestly don't know why you're watching Splunky on the internet. This and we got Octodad. a jetpack. Why? What is wrong with you people? Don't wait. Go get Octodad. It's just like people are putting frowny faces and like, yeah, I didn't get it yet. If you're sad, go get it. It's like, a, what is it? Like 12 bucks. Yeah, it's on 20% off now. Yeah. Max will send you 12 bucks. I'm I'm excited for the PS4 version too. I I somehow I saw one of those like press conferences and the one where they had the boom camera. Do you remember that the yep. real dramatic one? Yep. And I got so excited by that camera on the boom that I on the jib, the crazy jib rig thing that they had. So, see how these two? I leave these two. Okay. That way, when I'm standing here, they're gonna run straight at me because I'm below them rather than jump around. But they can't shoot me. Oh wow! Look at that. He paused, pointed that out. That is advanced oh. looking that. Oh, and what? Wow. Market. You're welcome. Black market tech. And where did his gun go? It went somewhere backwards, right? Where'd it go? I don't see it. Did it go down? Oh, there it is. All right. Do the ice gun. That one's just as good. Yeah. Is there any use for the web gun? You can like wall climb, you can like wall climb with it. Okay. Uh I've I've won in multiplayer with the web gun, because it, it surprises people. Not really, he can't get to me because Tiki's. Wait, hold on. Guys, is the music back? Yeah. Oh, they're all dead. Awesome. Yeah, good job, Tommy. Thanks. Nicely done. 
get that pack. Anyway, so I bought a PS4 in Excitement, I pre-ordered it, and I gave it to Phil, and I haven't even asked for it back, because there's not a single game I want to play on it. Two jetpacks, two jetpacks. Count them. So I'm, I'll be excited for Octodad on PS4 too. And uh, playing that game with uh, the move stuff, control the yeah, that's gonna be really side. dumb. I'm very excited for that. Yeah, or as I like to call them, the Joust controllers. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't. Was it this guy have Joust owns, controller support? Like, anyone that owns more than one um, move controller, <laughs> it has somehow has had early access to Joust. That's the only reason. Oh shit! Yeah. That was almost hilarious. Well, I, I threw a bomb and it stuck on the guy instead, and then the tiki knocked him back, and it, we just put him in a classic Spelunky death. Emerging gameplay. Straight line. That's pretty cool. Yeah. I don't even know it. I don't even know it. It's like one of those things. You know, you just kind of now, but now I get some ability. Right. But you can't like this. Yeah. 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 I heard a dog. I just wanted to see if it was accessible. Get your own tunnel. Dig your own tunnel, yes. Clapic. My problem with the tunnel guy is that I'm, I'm trying to dig him across three different instances of Spelunky. I have right. tunnels in uh, the Vita version, I have tunnels in this version of Spelunky at home, and then tunnels in this version of Spelunky. So I never end up doing the, the big tunnel guy. I think we'd have like a... What is that? Is that a tragedy of the commons? If we all play on this one and we're all just like, well, I'm not going to do it. It's not my box. Yeah. Like, yeah. Is that what that is? Or is that a, that's just a collective decision. No, that's a, that's a free rider problem. A free rider problem. Okay. Which the tragedy of the tragedy commons of the is commons a, is would be like if we bad. all used the tunnels too much because it wasn't, they, we, they weren't ours and we somehow right. used them up. Yeah. Just hang up there, dog. You got it. You learn for fun. <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, oh know. shit. Uh -oh. Yeah, you don't have climbing gloves. Oh! L, 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 That's true, he's right. And it'd be fun to show people. Because we're a mouse. Woo! I'm gonna throw up! <laughs> I know. Well, that's where we're adding the. 10 health. The, the, the 10 health. Boy, 10 health. That really. It, yeah. it sure is a good thing I had an excessive amount of health. Well, it took off six there, right? Yep. So. ABP. Always be prepared. That's Jana. Yep. I'm really not liking not having the climb. Oh good, the Maui head. So this is a freebie basically. I get to be just a sloppy asshole. Like I was last time. Now you can do whatever you want. Yep. That's what I love about the zone. It's the the only time you can be completely Got him! The only time you can be completely stress free in sport. Right. The ice caves are a nice breather, aren't they? No, but I just mean this one in particular where you're you have to die anyway. Oh yeah, yeah. I find Literally the ice caves. I find the ice caves, especially with the jetpack. I find the ice caves with the jetpack to just generally be the most the really, most fun yeah, in yeah. Spelunky. Because you really are like in complete control. 
and you don't have to worry as much about the shopkeepers. Yeah, they can just fall over the edge and you'll never have to lift them. They do it every time, too, like fucking idiots. Try my trust Is this with your new stuff? I roast, when the shopkeeper I those just beans. runs off, that's pretty great. The other yeah. thing is when they murder each other to death. Unionize or something. You all look the same. How do you not have it? They murder each other to death. Is that that thing you got in the mail? The thing that the, lights up, the thing that you are told it, this will light on fire? Yeah, I did not light it on fire yet. Yeah. How does it light on fire? Yeah, if you roast too dark. I mean, the coffee. So the coffee beans are like they they shed what's called chaff. It's like the papery outside of the coffee bean, and that stuff is just like tinder. So it collects in the bottom of the thing, and then if you make it too hot, it just goes up in flames. Sounds old. It's like the scariest instruction manual I've ever read in my life. They're like. Listen, congratulations on your purchase. You should know this thing will set on fire. Here are the contingency plans that, to put in place in case that happens, like when that happens. So it's, it's not a question of, like, uh, if it, you're, it's a question of when? If you're like very it, careful and you clean it all the time, it, it, okay. should, it won't set on fire. But clearly they know that people won't do that enough, so they have to put in warning that Yeah. Flat. Yeah. And then you, also it was pretty funny, like, when you open it, in order to, like, open it, you have to, like, rip this sticker off the front, and the sticker is just, like... You acknowledge by removing this sticker that you may set this machine and your house on fire and you cannot sue us and you might die using it. Enjoy your coffee. Like <laughs> really good. Juice that dog. Oh, don't say it like that. Don't yeah, say it like juice that. that dog. Oh, nice and done. Hey, and a shotgun. Count me, you're in it. This is good. Yeah, you're doing great. Thanks. Yeah, remember, you you have a sacrifice, too, up. So if you get a, an altar, you'll get that uh, health bonus. Uh, I think I I didn't do a, a third sacrifice yet. No. no I just, thought you did. We just oh, oh, okay. Wow. Big plays. That could have gone way tech. wrong. Those guys are so full of blood. <laughs> Those you guys have so much blood. Do they really? They yeah. have more than three drops? Yeah. Those are just little, little blood balls. I think I always... be green, but they're full of blood. I make the mistake of assuming the blood has dried up when it yeah, yeah, yeah. stays there a lot longer, and I, I need to break myself of that habit. Tommy, I'm just saying the chat really wants to see you do the uh, mothership. Do they? They do. That sucks for the chat. <laughs> I don't like to tell you. They're going to be very disappointed this <laughs> They sure are. Whatever. They're, go back and look at the moment it was Greg where he did... The worm and the mothership back to back. Yeah. Well, because he screwed up the Ankh, though. Oh, uh, yes. well. He still did both. Yeah. 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 It was impressive. Yeah, that was a crazy. That was a good run. He was like hanging on by a thread the whole time. You know how you get really good at Spelunky? Learn to tell the chat when to fuck off. I'm on a. I'm on a Yama run. <laughs> That's how you get good at Spelunky. Bye, man! Wait, is that real? Jesse Eisenberg is Lex Luthor. Are they just at this point? They're just trying to make me see this movie because I, I need to know how much to hate it. Like, yeah, yeah. is that actually it. true? It's what multiple people in the chat are saying? Dog stats <laughs> juiced. <laughs> Uh, oh, good. Scar. Wait, That's what? who we need. Wait, those are different shows. Those are different comic books. Yeah. They're the same. That's They're doing Superman and Batman. In oh, it's, is, that, there, is that how they're relaunching it? It's like... No, it's a sequel. It's a sequel to Man of Steel with, bat, with old Batman. I hate this. <laughs> it's Ben Affleck. It's fine. To those of you who can't see, oh, Max shit. is throwing up right now. I like Jesse Eisenberg too, but that just seems like really weird casting. All right. I, I Jesse Eisenberg. Oh wow, that is so useful! Holy shit! Yeah. Jesse Eisenberg, I will say like he picks good movies. Like I don't think that dude's been in a bad movie. No. Zombieland was Zom great. Zombieland was great. Social Network was very good. All right. Where is his been fucking in? staff? He's go. great in Arrested Development. Of it, Which one? Tommy, this happened to Greg one time. 
Were you watching that? Did it melt in the lava? No, it was just gone. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Oh, that is perfect. No. It's just graphics. Don't be scared of the graphics. Ooh, we got another outfit. I'm, gonna really, I'm, I'm really gonna spike the football on health here. Yeah, I wanna see this, please. Yeah, go for it. Oh, oh god! And you got a mummy. Wait, what happened? Just throw him, throw him down there, he'll set it off. Um. Yeah. yeah, but it's gonna come straight across. That was awesome. That was a good move. Dude tech. Mm, I don't like all this. All these mummies. Can you gather the bomb? Yeah, but that's not a good position to do it from. Like, I'm not in a really. Good I actually spot. don't know how to. I don't know how you set yourself up to gather the I'll, bomb. I've died like that a few. I'll ways. show you in the the city of gold's the best place to do it because you're guaranteed mummies in certain configurations. Okay. No, but it's like it's it's standardized in some ways, in some important ways. Dude, those um those flying scorpions, if you can sacrifice them alive, they're worth as much as a uh, dog. Oh wow, they're very valuable. How did that not stick to him? Fuck him. I saw that. Oh shit. He's gonna murder himself to death. Trying what? No. I'm gonna get his blood. Oh, you got a dog though? Yeah. He's gonna get all his blood. I think if I can... So that shopkeeper is worth a little under half a dog once he's dead. There's, a, there's a one more dead human down there. Yeah, you could sacrifice that guy. Well, we'll see. Oh, yeah, I can't put space for it, but I'll risk it. I've got enough help. So close. I've never used the staff after the one time I used it and it killed me. I don't that's a good... Yeah, never, that's, that's a good never, ever going to use it again. It's not really worth it. Like the, You get rid of it so quickly that I don't know why you would bother. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, yep, that was dumb. That was dumb. I saw it happen. I missed that. Yeah, I, wait, wait, wait. I, an arrow hit me and knocked me into... Instant replay, instant replay. Oh, I shit on my too. dick. <laughs> We're watching you fail right now. Yeah. Here it comes. Don't worry. It happens really Ooh, quick. Tommy, watch out for that lava. Well, you know... Oh! <laughs> Not satisfying. That's pretty classic Spelunky. Not satis- no satisfaction. Uh, Man, I really- god damn it. Alright, well, I think, uh, Brad's doing something at one, so I think that's- Daily Dota. Uh, alright, thanks everyone for tuning in. We will be back on Monday. Uh, the end of this feature as a regular thing for, like, an extended period of the day will be when we beat Yama, but we have not done that yet. Probably so. Monday. I'm guessing Monday. Uh, yeah, I think, like, yeah. one more run. Yeah. I mean, I think then we'll be good. Then I'll yeah. master the game and, uh, I can just hang it up and spend. Then, oh, then get ready for the uh, the morning uh, FTL uh, nap together. Yeah, yeah. Napping with scoops. <laughs> yeah, I'll just take a nap and I'll just have some scripts run and then we'll just uh, we'll do that. So yeah. uh, thanks everyone for tuning Ooh, in which and uh, laser upgrade will you get? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> See you guys on Monday. I'm gonna ban Max.
Yeah! Yeah! That's a Woo! Woo! That's pretty good. Chris Remo! <laughs> oh, look at Brad Shoemaker. Suck it. Oh! One, one, zero. Oh, he's still playing. He's probably playing right now. Should we call him? Because, yeah. You want to call yeah. him? I don't know if I have Brad's number. No, call Jeff. I think he's playing right now. Oh, Jeff is playing. Jeff is okay. playing right now. Uh, I don't know my little speaker thing. We'll have to put it right up to the microphone. You should, should pick it up. Apologize for my suck it, Kelly. That is <laughs> that's inappropriate, and I am better than that. Sorry. Publication. Richard Sherman. I like how this stream is just gradually becoming us harassing Jeff on the phone. <laughs> hey, it's Jeff. Leave a message. Aww. Boo. Well, we tried. Curious to see what Jeff ends up getting. 185 for the day. Feel pretty good about that. It's so really like all it came down to with uh, Chris and I did the exact same thing. We both beat Olmec. Yeah. Um, I just collected a little bit more it may have him. been that you spent the time getting those gems at the end yeah that might i mean look i mean that's the difference of just oh, under twenty thousand. I, I got jeff here okay hey jeff hey how you doing pretty good uh patrick and i are calling you on the splunkin with scoops stream that, that sounds like a lame stream i'm in my car streaming i'm <laughs> so wait, so so you actually only got zero? Like it says you played. Uh yeah, I don't know. So something weird happened where I went to go play it last night, but I got home early, so I think I might have played before to reset, and it let me play the same level twice. What? So um, what? So I, I the first time I got like twenty three thousand or something. Jeff, and can... then I played again and got like twenty. Congratulations, the developers of Splunky could not account for your lifestyle in the way that they programmed their algorithm of how human beings live. Yeah, I, that's, <laughs> I'm just, I'm an enigma, man. I'm a Splunky enigma. They can't that's crazy. chase me down. Yeah, so, and then, so, so then I waited an hour and launched it again, thinking like, okay, it's probably reset by now, and the new challenge is there. But then it said I had already played it and it wouldn't let me play again. So, I don't know, as far as I'm concerned, it's broken, and any scores generated today or yesterday are null and void. <laughs> but I beat the game. <laughs> no, sorry, it doesn't count. <laughs> God damn it! 300,000! That's, that's an official ruling, Patrick, I'm sorry. That's true. There's no appeal, yep. there's no appeal for that. Uh. No, no ball on that one. Damn. All right. Well, that's good to know. Thanks. Th thanks for the clarification, Jeff. Yeah, I'm glad I could help. Talk to you guys later. Talk All to you right. later. All right. Did Ooh. you want to give one a shot? Or you want to just call it there? No, let's call it. I'll, I'll do one on that a, was on that a was a while. Stream. That was. A I'm while. not gonna do better than that. Yeah. All right. Uh, thanks everyone for tuning in. That was super fun. We beat Olmec and we beat Chris Remo. Hail Patrick. Oh, what did it really F say? Olmec. Oh. <laughs> what did he say? Remo. Replied to the Clubic vs. Remo account and goes, Fuck you. That's <laughs> <laughs> what you get, Remo. Don't come in my house. That's it. That's the end of the stream. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Although maybe we should just call this feature and never do it again. Bye. Oh, you gotta beat hell. Yeah, I gotta beat hell. That's our new goal. On to hell. Alright, see you guys.